Hey everyone, this is Sherry from Planning Peep and welcome back to my channel. For today, I am doing my plan with me for the week of September 25th through October 1st. So we are transitioning into October this week and it's crazy because this year has just flown by and I'm actually nearing my one year anniversary of my channel, which is really exciting. I am hoping to do something really fun, something exciting for that. So um, that's at the end of November. Okay, so it's still kind of far away. I don't even know why I'm like already jumping ahead. But um, anyways, for this week, I will be using this kit from Very Jenny Co. I recently featured this in a haul video. She was very, very kind and sent me these stickers to try out. So I was super excited to be able to use this kit. It's really perfect for fall. Um, and I just absolutely love this box with the rain boots. Um, so I already think that's gonna be my top corner box just cause I love that so much. But anyways, here are the full boxes. We have the bottom washi and date covers, weekend banner, etc. on this page. Here we've got the um, heart checklists. We have icons, more heart checklists, sidebar trackers, and bill dues. We've got the headers and the little things here, and then we have um, half boxes and tech stickers, which she has quite a few that are all really cute. So I'm really excited to use this kit. Um, I have never used one of her kits before, so it's always really fun kind of trying to figure out the format when using kits from a new shop. So yeah, let's just dive right in with the bottom washi as usual, and then we will build the spread from there. For the washi this week, I decided to layer the two strips that came in the kit. So I put the thinner one on top and then the thicker, darker one on the bottom and I like how that turned out. And then for my sidebar, like I mentioned, I really wanted the um, full box with the boots to be my corner box. I didn't really feel like using the Fashion Girl this week. I don't know why. I think um, it was actually really hot this week and so her with her like raincoat and umbrella just really didn't speak to me so I decided to leave that box out and then I put down a flag in the top corner to cover the one that was on the planner I um there was like a strip of gold I don't know if you saw it on the bottom so I cut that strip in half so that I could make headers out of them so I put down one of those makeshift headers and then I used a habit tracker to track my running the shoe sticker is from panda bird designs and then I used the happy mail sticker that came in the kit with a three heart scallop label to mark the happy Happy meal packages that I was expecting for the week. Underneath, I put down or I layered some washi and used the dinners header over it. And then I put down the Monday through Sunday tracker to track my dinners. Then moving on to Monday, I started by using one of those makeshift headers, um, the gold glitter ones, and then I decided to put down all of my date covers. Um, so before I put down Sunday, I used the last or one of the flags to cover up that top flag again on that side. And then I found these little date dots. I think it was a leftover from a kit that I used back in April. And so I just put in the dots for the week. I decided to trim down the header because it was just a little bit too thick. And then I put down a coffee sticker that came in the kit because it was Monday after all. And um, I was definitely going to need some coffee in the morning before I went to work. I also had an early meeting um, at 7.30. So I used a half box with an IEP sticker from Lily Grove Designs to mark that. I then put down a to-do header with a four heart checklist to mark the things that I had to get done at work. At the end of the day, I decided to use a another makeshift header. So there was another strip with um, that yellow color. I cut those into headers as well and just left that at the bottom of Monday. For Tuesday, I started by using a today header. Initially, I put down this flag with a bow paper clip sticker that is from Very Cute Designs, but I decided I wanted some background and so I used a full box. I used a heart icon sticker to mark a meeting that I had in the morning, again at 7.30, so I had to be at work pretty early. And then I put down a, another heart icon to mark an afternoon meeting afterwards. I used another one of those gold glitter headers and put down a five heart checklist to mark my to-dos at work for that day. And then moving on to Wednesday, I started by using a half box at the top and um, that alarm clock icon came in the kit. I also used a little pencil sticker because I wanted to mark um, a testing appointment that I had with a student. I then put down a to-do header with a heart checklist um, underneath that for my to-dos that day. And that's pretty much it. I didn't have any meetings on Wednesday, so I move on to Thursday. I used one of those gold headers or gold glitter headers at the top, and then I put down the scarf full box at the top of the day. I also didn't have any meetings on Thursday, lucky me. And so I just went ahead and put down the full box to take up some space. I used a gray header that I cut up and that remember sticker, the remember script sticker is from Nightingale Paper Co. 
And now moving on to Friday. So I started by using a Today header and then I used a Clever Gal Craft um, Gold Heart icon to mark that it's Friday. And I used a quarter box with a coffee sticker because I always want to get coffee on Fridays. Um, I think on this day I didn't end up going, but um, I always like to try to get coffee on Fridays because it's kind of like a hurrah for making it through the week. And I used a gold glitter header with a to-do um, script sticker also from Nightingale Paper Co. It came in the same sheet as the Remember stickers. And then I used um, a heart checklist underneath for my to-dos and I move on to the weekend. I started the weekend by putting down some washi strips at the top, and then this weekend banner was like so, so difficult to get on straight. Um, I kept messing with it, and I like just couldn't position it well on one side where it would be like straight on the other. And so yeah, I struggled with that for a bit before finally getting it on and moving on. So I used a um, half box, and that balloon sticker I'm putting down right now is from Mandy Dreams. Um, the payday sticker came in the kit. So Saturday was payday, which is really exciting. I only get paid once a month, unfortunately. So um, I don't get to use payday stickers very often. So anyways, here is everything that I can pre-plan. So if you're new to my channel, I usually pre-plan all my work events and all my work meetings first before the week begins. And then I go in like every day, every few days to plan the things that happen in my personal life. So first things first, um, on Monday, I used a quarter box with a gas sticker to mark that I got gas after work. And then my boyfriend and I just had, um, we made some curry for dinner, not from scratch. We just heated up like this Costco brand curry that we love. It's so good. And then um, that curry sticker is from Sticker Sis. And then at the end of the night, we watched Narcos, which we were totally binging this week. And so I used a little things to mark that. On Tuesday, I started by putting down a full box with a Little Things header, but then later on, I removed the full box just because um, I don't really remember why. I think it was because I already had a full box on Tuesday at the top and I didn't want there to be two in a day. So anyways, I layered over it a half box and that Me Time sticker came in the kit and the little girl with the YouTube icon that is from Paper and Milk. I absolutely love her little icons. They're so cute. I think that girl's name is Momo. But anyways, I replaced those stickers without the full box on the back and the TV sticker that I end up putting down is from Once More With Love and it's like a little munchkin watching Netflix underneath blankets, which is pretty much what I look like. So then for Wednesday, I used a glitter header with a full box and then I used a quarter box with an edit sticker from very cute designs to mark that I was editing my plan with me this was the collab that I was putting up last week and we went to run club and did a really really tough run that day so I wanted to mark that specifically the shoe sticker is from K stickers co and then at the end of the night after run club our friends and I went and got whole foods and we just ate dinner there so I used a quarter box with a coffee monsters co meal icon I fill in some of my sidebar and then I move on to Thursday. So Thursday, I did not plan chronologically. I decided to start from the bottom. So we went on our date night on Thursdays, which we have been doing for a while. It just kind of is a great way for us to like de-stress from the week. And I used a half box for that with a beer sticker from Dizzy Daisy Dreams. And then the date night sticker came in the kit. Um, then I move up and I put down some washi strips with a planner that came in the kit. That upload sticker is from K Stickers Co. And I had uploaded the collab plan with me that I did last week with Plants with Vanessa. So hopefully you guys got to catch that and then I had to stop by somebody's house to pick up something so I used a house icon from the kit and I don't know if you noticed but my to-do list on Wednesday Thursday Friday were empty and that's because um at that school I currently have so so much to do that it actually makes more sense for me to write down a master to-do list than to write it every day. So this was the first time actually that my planner has not been functional for me for work. Um, but yeah, I don't know. It was just like so overwhelming that I couldn't split up my to-do list by days. I had to just work off of a master, but, um, Anyways, resuming with the plan with me, on Friday I used a Little Things header with a half box and the Chinese food sticker is from Plans with Finesse and I paired that with a Coffee Monsters Co. emoji face because Payway was having a buy one get one deal and Payway is like one of my favorite places to go. I love their pad thai, it's so good. So that was like my favorite thing ever. I went with a friend and so we both definitely binged on some noodles. And then I put down a um, camera sticker with a film sticker again from K Stickers Co. Um, that night I did sleep early because it had been a really stressful week at work. And so I put down that sleeping girl from Plans with Vanessa. Then moving on to Saturday, I put down a to-do header with a um, little quarter box and an asterisk sticker to mark that we drove down to San Diego. Um, and then I decided to work backwards because I didn't know how much space I needed. Um, at the bottom, I used a full box and put down a gold glitter header. 
And then, um, so once I knew how much space I had left, I put down, I think that banner is from Sweet Bean Plans. I haven't used one of those in a really long time, but this was kind of the perfect time to do it because, um, there was a brewery in San Diego that was celebrating their one year anniversary. So we definitely wanted to go show our support because we really like their beer. And so we drove down there and that beer sticker is from Dizzy Daisy Dreams. And then we drove back home and went and got Korean barbecue with some friends, which was really good. So I put down a half box and the Korean barbecue sticker is from Plants with Vanessa. I also put down a gold foil car sticker that is from Planning World to mark our drive home. And then for Sunday, I started by using a gold glitter header. I put down a, um, I keep saying they're quarter boxes. They're actually bill due and payday stickers that came in the kit. But since I don't really use them, I just use them as quarter boxes and like cover up the part that says bill due. Um, so that boba sticker is from Plants with Vanessa. We definitely wanted to get our weekly breakfast boba and bread. And then I used a full box underneath that. I did my nails so I could film my plan with me. That nail sticker came in the kit. And then I filmed a bunch on Sunday. And so I used a little flag sticker with a Coffee Monsters Co. YouTube emoji. My friend came over afterwards because she had left some stuff at my house that she wanted to pick up. And so um, I used a quarter box and that box sticker is from Echo Hui Craft Co. Then afterwards, I did some laundry. That laundry sticker is really, really cute, but it came in a sampler. So I don't remember. I had like cut it out so I don't have the shop name, unfortunately. And then we went and did barbecue at a friend's house. So I used a quarter box and the barbecue sticker is from Sticker Sis. I then move on to filling out my sidebar. I finished filling everything in. I actually only expected two packages this week. I only purchased from two shops over the PBC sale. So yeah, that's pretty much it for this week's spread. I feel like it was pretty simple, kind of like straightforward. Um, I did fill in those to-dos on Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday afterwards, just because I don't like having my planner be completely blank. So I just went in and put down some of the things that I did end up getting done at work. Sorry, I'm a little behind schedule with my videos right now. Work has just been really, really stressful and crazy. And so I just haven't really had the energy to edit when I get home. But oops, sorry, that was my that was my phone. Let me silence that. OK, so anyways, I just really haven't had time to edit. But um, thank you so much for bearing with me and still supporting my channel. I really, really appreciate that. You guys know that I appreciate every like, every comment, every view. So, yeah, thank you for being awesome. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.